Where are you living now? I, okay, so this is very much the way that I work. I write a song about Malibu and how much I love it, and then I move back to Nashville. That's just the way that I roll. Um, so I've been in Nashville, but now I'm back in Malibu, and I'm back and forth being able to be close to LA so I can work on new projects. What about your... You know what it is. What about the pig that you own? Does that pig travel with the you back and forth? The pig is a Malibuian. Is it that is. a thing? A Malibuian? Yeah, that's... She's in Malibu, happy as can be. She was in St. Louis, and someone... I think I told you this, brought her to a meet and greet and said, hey, I love... I know you love animals. Here. And gave me a pig. You were stuck with that pig, yeah. Yeah, and then I actually took the pig to a Four Seasons in Chicago and hit her in the closet every time I got room service. For real? There was, like, dogs and cats were kind of allowed, but I had a feeling a pig was a hard no. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you hid the pig in the closet. Yeah. And so the pig goes with you everywhere. How does you transport the pig? Doritos. Okay, so the way we do this is we just have to get Doritos and it just kind of, it'll, it, uh, pretty much any food, but Doritos are Pig Pig's favorite. So you will lay a trail of Doritos and then Yeah, the pig, one no. time I actually got her to work with Snoop Dogg and yeah. she had to rap, which was very, I couldn't do it without Doritos. It was a miracle. We Snoop gave her Doritos. Also, that's how they get him to go places. They leave Doritos. Doritos everywhere. Yeah. Yes, actually, it's a long story. We'll talk about it another time, but my grandma cooked him edibles and then. My pig was eating Doritos and... What? But my... It's a long story. We'll talk about it after. Your grandma cooked... Okay, so, yeah. Okay, so my grandma doesn't know she cooked him edibles. We did this in CG. We told my grandma she was going to cook brownies, uh -huh. but then this was for the VMAs. That's why I was here last time. And then we superimposed marijuana into her... So I don't know if she actually watched the VMAs, but sorry, Mammy, you cooked edibles. But she doesn't know. <laughs> she really cooked brownies, and then we added weed in post. Is it possible that she's been in prison all this time since then? <laughs> If her, yeah. You yeah, are no be. longer smoking, I understand. I want to be, but no. Now that it's legal here in California, you've decided... That's the way that I... I'm a rebel. ...to give it up. Yeah. yeah. Why aren't you smoking anymore? Um, because I am very focused on what I'm working on right now. Mm -hmm. And I think... I also think it is the most magical, amazing, it's my first and true love, but it's just not for me at this time in my life. But I'm sure there will be a day I will happily indulge. I see. I see what you're saying. Yeah. But it's true, yeah, because you can get in, like, a rhythm of yeah. not doing anything. Yeah, I actually just got... This is really random. You would never expect this. But Liam was playing the UFC video game, and I told him how dumb it was until the controller got in my hand one time. And now it's my favorite thing in the world is smoking pot and playing UFC video. Yeah, right. Either one of those things can It's take... not very productive. Not productive at all. No. L you posted something. I want to ask you, because Liam apparently likes to scare you. It's, yes, constantly. So you, you video... Well, you got videotape of this. I would imagine most of them aren't <laughs> on videotape. But let's take a look at this. I was already scared. Watch how happy he is here. Yeah. I was. I was already scared. That was what was so annoying, as I was putting... And this is bad. I know that it's May, and I was putting our Christmas decorations away, finally. I like lights, and I like shiny things, so no. they... And elves, and they just live for, like, a whole summer. So now it was time. May 1st. Christmas got to go. You so, really had your Christmas decorations so up. They're so cute. Santa makes me feel uh, safe. You it's passed safe. the halfway mark. You could have just I passed it on. like Valentine's goes, Easter goes, and they're Santa. When will they go back up again? Probably by the 4th of July. Yeah, you were smoking too much yeah. pot, for yeah. sure. Yeah. You don't believe me that I don't smoke <laughs> anymore. No. Um, no, so I was there. So I was already in this really creepy basement. Uh -huh. And so I was coming up to say, oh, my God, that basement is so scary. And then he jumped out at the worst time. And is this something that really bothers you or you're okay with it? I just don't know why... I haven't caught on to this is all, but it's like, I don't know he's around every corner. He's around a lot of corners. Do you ever try to get him back? I'm obviously loud, and so I'm not very good at scaring You're people. You're too loud to scare people. Because I'm like, <laughs> and he's like, I can hear you back there behind the door. This would be a good title for a book, Too Loud to Scare yeah, People. Yeah, Too Loud to Scare, <laughs> with too big of hair. If you like that video, then put a ring on it. Click the subscribe button below. Uh-oh-oh. Oh.